Initializing a virtual drive. You must log in with admin privileges to perform this task. Note, all data on a virtual drive is lost when you initialize the drive. Before you run an initialization, back up any data on the virtual drive that you want to save. In the navigation pane, click the Storage tab and select the RAID controller. On the Work pane, click the Virtual Drive Info tab and then click Virtual Drives. In the Virtual Drives area, choose the drive that you want to initialize. Then click Initialize. Choose the type of initialization you want to use for the virtual drive. You can either choose the Fast Initialize option that allows you to start writing data to the virtual drive immediately, or the Full Initialize option that allows you to initialize the drive completely on a new configuration. Note that you cannot write data to the new virtual drive until the initialization is complete. For this demonstration, we'll use Fast Initialize. Click Initialize VD to initialize the drive. To verify the initialization is complete, click the Storage Log tab. The status of the initialized disk is displayed here. This completes initializing a virtual drive.